The province of Iloilo is located in the center of the Philippine archipelago. The province comprises the southeastern part of Panay Island. The capital city of the province is the city of Iloilo, which is also one of the major urban centers in the Philippines. It is also known as the City of Love. How to get there? By air. Iliili International Airport is a new airport of international standards, about 40 kilometers outside the city. A flight from Manila to Iliilo takes one hour. Cebu Pacific and Philippine Airlines currently fly four times daily, while Air Philippines flies three times daily. By bus. The city is a transportation hub of Panay and nearby islands, including Boracay and Guimaras. There are several bus companies that provide transportation to other major urban areas of Panay, Taliboy Nakan, San Jose and Antique, Roaz and Capiz, and Pasas City in Iloilo. The Ceres Bus Company and others provide bus services up to Manila via the roll-on, roll-off route. Here are the most visited tourist spots and attractions in Iloilo Province, Philippines. Bukari Pine Forest and Campsite If you want to be closer with nature and seek adventure away from the city, then traveling from Haro Haro to Leon should probably be included in your itinerary. The Bukani Pine Forest and Campsite is a perfect venue for guests who want to commune with nature any time of the day. Guests can pitch their tent, bike their way to the campsite, and climb atop to see the breathtaking panoramic view of the mountain ranges of Alibudan and Leon. Caminha Balay na Bato If you want to immerse and enter the beautiful houses built under colonial Spanish influence, then the Caminha Balay na Bato, situated at Osmeña Street in Villa de Arevalo, Iloilo City, is the place to be. Here in this house, you'll see relics, antique furniture, old photographs, and religious altars. Dinagyang Festival Celebrate and be in one with the free-spirited Ilongos when you take part in the world-class Dinagyang Festival held every fourth Sunday of January. Some of the highlights of this festival include the street dance competition, cultural presentation, and a firework display to cap off the event. Who would have thought that heaven is found in Iloilo? If you'll traverse on the southernmost town of the province of Iloilo, you'll get to visit Garin Farm, where the popular pilgrimage site in San Joaquin is located. The site features a holy installation from the huge sculptures, saints, and nothing but white elements to portray the heaven-like feels of the place. Contemporary Art Iloilo Museum of Contemporary Art is the first art institution in the region that exhibits the works of both Filipino and foreign modern and contemporary artists. Other than artworks, there is also an exhibit for personal collections, a theater, and an events facility with state-of-the-art audio technology. River Esplanade. If you want to unwind or witness the Iloilo sunset, 
then it's best for you to visit the Ilihila River Esplanade. It's a multifunctional place that serves as an eco park, fitness, and recreational venue perfect for locals and newcomers in the city. The city has put a major effort not only to rehabilitate the Ilihila River, but to also promote active lifestyles amongst its locals. Gigantas Islands, Carles Iloilo. I wouldn't be surprised if you'll include Gigantas Islands in your itinerary. It's a paradise like no other. And one should really visit to know why it's a popular destination in Iloilo. Situated at the northernmost part of Iloilo province, Islas de Gigantes is a must-visit paradise if you love the beach and picturesque view. To get here, you may get a ride via Carles and Estancia. Haro Cathedral Your Iloilo trip will never be completed without visiting the popular Haro Cathedral, hailed as Iloilo's oldest church. Haro Cathedral's architecture is very distinct where the bell tower is located across Haro Plaza. Nyagal Church, dubbed as an architectural wonder. Nyagal Church is also included in the list of World Heritage Sites by UNESCO. If you want to visit here, it will take you about a 30 to 40 minute drive from the city center. Its beautiful church with ornament carvings and two huge watchtower will freeze on each side. Those were the most visited places in Iloilo province. So on your next trip, don't miss the opportunity to explore those amazing attractions. This has been Ito Jerb, your friendly travel YouTuber. Thank you very much for watching. God bless us all and keep safe all the time.